Hi right, fucker, welcome back to another reaction. Today we have the Disturb and Vertar best of both. So, the DEF concert also released, so I'm going to be uploading uh, probably within three hours of releasing this set so that you can watch at the same time. So, I'm going to start off with the Rebirth set. Yeah, um, best of both, what can I say about it? There were so many fucking edits. I couldn't even keep up with how many edits there are. But there's just like a whole fuck ton of mashups, edits. I'm not too sure what they have to offer today, but all I know is that... Um, there was a rebuff, like, somewhere on TikTok, there was a clip of someone posting a Disturb and Vertal ID together. So, now I get to hear on HQ, and, you know, I finally get to give my review on it. So, without further ado, let's get on to this shit. Ah, I never talked about it before, but yeah, this is a really nice stage, I love it a lot. Look at my glorious kings, my gods. Rise again. Hustle, I flex, the world is mine. Right. It rains, it pours, I came, I saw, I Oh shit! Make it sound, everything changes! His unreleased discography is ridiculous. He needs to release a lot of music. Like, listen to this shit. Look at him. That guy's made. That guy is actually made. Heaven sent. Let's go. I have a feeling I know what song this is, but I'm not too sure. Oh, this is such a throwback. Desi Bell. That song in ages. Oh, wow, why? Because I'll get it. I've never seen D Star with a beat. Rockstar, D-Stub? I can't wait to see D-Stub at Knockout. I missed out on Showtech. You know, your boy gotta uh, make up lost time. And he has his Through Your Veins album. Oh, I can't wait to hear all of those songs live. I feel like I wasted my time And I feel like I wasted my life I wanna see how many people get faked here I'm pretty sure this is the first time he actually previewed this edit I get no I'm getting goosebumps all over my face. This shit is so beautiful. Oh, I'm getting goosebumps. My eyes are getting teary. I'm not gonna lie with you. 
It's so beautiful. I'm so glad that he added the U4 drop to this song. Made the song so much better as well. The hard drop was really nice, but euphoric drop. Wow, look at those lights. Huh? Huh? Is it the Edda? Oh. <laughs> I'm surprised that he didn't play this song at Mafia, if I'm being honest with you. Like, yeah, it's 30 minutes, I get it, but... You know, this is Bertar's, one of his most iconic songs. I'm not getting fake today! Is this the edit? Ready? Oh, sorry. Is this the new song? Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> inspired drop sounds like it pretty good i enjoy the fake drop to that the bonk part might need a few more listens but everything else about the track pretty fucking cool is it better than open your heart i still think that it's an unfinished track because it feels too short right that's that was only basically a minute so i can give a final review once it's finished this this is is but it's been nearly a whole year since he's previewed this i'm also sad he didn't play this at mafia but you know we got camp b and everything changes i'm not complaining That's me and the boys. W. Hey, Twitch. I feel like Shocker's one was better. Why is that? Probably Vertal's working on a lot of solo stuff at this time. Also, Disturb had his album around this period as well. This is when he actually released the Through Your Veins. So I can see why it's not as exciting as the Shocker set. Because the Shocker set was really crazy. There was so much going on with it. And it was definitely kept me on my feet. This one, they kind of just, it's okay. It's not too, too bad. Will I listen to it again? I won't say no if someone put it in the rotation, but you know, I would rather put other sets. I feel like they played together better before, which is shockers. Anyway, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.